This weapon is absolutely breaking Modern Warfare 2 with the KV Broadside Shotgun. This thing takes zero skill to use, so if you hate your enemies, bust out this baby and they'll hate you too. So here is an overview of my new f you class in Modern Warfare 2. I got these perks and these field upgrades, and you know, every single enemy is gonna hate you. And here's an overview of the full build. You guys can see, despite having that 25 round man, we still have a pretty good sprint speed. The only thing I'm really not liking is the ADS speed. Like, look at this. Oh my days, that thing is so slow. But once you get used to it, you should be able to pop off. Trust me. By the way, do you want that Orion camel, but you're just a little bit too busy to grind through all 2,000 camels? If so, you should definitely check out Guapsi. Guapsi provides weapon leveling services, camel unlock services, challenge unlock services, such as the Warzone Nuke, and many more for all the platforms. Okay, for the first attachment, we are going to be going over to the stock. And since this gun really doesn't have the best mobility, that is the biggest downside. Throw on the stock. Stock this, this is going to severely increase the mobility. The ADS speed is still going to be horrendous, but it's not going to be as bad. What I also looked at was the Ultra Zat stock. This is going to increase the sprint speed. The stock list does not do that. So I tested out the movement speed for both of them, and you really don't notice a difference. The only thing you are noticing is the mobility increase that you are getting with the stock list. And so I do really recommend you guys to run the stock list. Next up, you guys want to go over to the barrel. This is going to severely increase the damage range of the weapon. This thing is super inconsistent. Like when I first first was using the weapon, I absolutely hated it. Sometimes at medium range, you'll get a one shot, then sometimes at point blank range where the barrel is up their ass, you will literally get a hip marker. Super inconsistent gun, and so the range 12 is going to make it a little bit more consistent. And just so you guys know, this barrel is hurting the mobility by a ton. This is going to be the thing that slows down the ADS the most, but it's just that damage range increase that really makes it worth it. And then for the tuning, bring up the aim, walking speed, and the ADS speed. Previously, I did increase the damage range, which gave us like a little bit more damage range, but then it really hurt the ADS speed. So I really don't recommend to increase the damage range. If you want, you can keep it at zero. But for me, since I'm so aggressive, I usually like to increase the mobility. And for the next attachment, usually we would go over to the muzzle and we would throw in one of the chokes that's going to increase the damage range and the uh, it's going to tighten up the pellet spread, which in return would give you more one shot kills because more of the pellets are hitting the enemy. But I found that it really didn't help the weapon at all. This weapon has a very good damage range. It's just very inconsistent that all the pellets will hit the enemy, but since the damage range is so good, I found you really don't need it. Like, it doesn't change the shots to kill whatsoever. I was still getting, like, two shot kills at close range with it and without it. The thing that is going to be a complete game changer is when you go over to the ammunition and you want to be a menace and throw on those fire rounds. This is going to hurt the damage range, but you're not going to really notice it, like, kind of, but if you can hit the enemy, they will catch on fire, and so you literally just need one shot, you can look away, then they'll just burn to death, which sounds really bad. I couldn't imagine if you had this video on like the big screen and someone walks around the corner and just hears that with all that said though i will give you a variation in case you do not want to run the dragon's breath i just found it is so much better with it and since we are losing so much damage range that is a big reason i'm running the range 12 and for the tuning on this guy we're just going to increase the damage range the hip walking speed really doesn't matter and then for the bottom one just to make the pellets hit the enemy a little bit quicker you're not going to really notice it that much but i found it is helpful to increase the ball velocity which by the way this isn't based on a linear scale so you get the most amount of bow velocity when you increase it by plus seven uh, to six rather than if you were to max that out. Next up, you guys want to go over to the bolts and this is going to severely increase the uh, the fire rate of the weapon. When you throw on this, literally everybody, especially on shipping, is going to completely hate you. You might even get shadow banned by the amount of people reporting you. Also, the enemies are going to throw on their shotgun. So that's why I typically don't really use this gun. I only use it if the enemies like throw it on. Before we throw on that last attachment, I just want to show you guys the ADS speed is still pretty good. Like it's slow but it's not like that bad and then uh, it seems pretty weak but you guys will see in the gameplay that burn effect is literally doing everything so for this attachment this is personal preference for me i like to be a complete asshole and i'm gonna go over to the magazine and i'm gonna throw on the 25 round mag now you can play shipping and just completely be an utter hell to all your enemies i don't know what they were thinking by adding a 25 round magazine to this gun like what the hell but it is hurting the mobility by so much i just think it is worth it to have a little bit less mobility to just be a complete menace say you do not want to run the magazine try going over to the rear grip and you can throw on the true tag grip which is going to increase the mobility 
and for the tuning max out the mobility on the gun it's going to make it feel a lot better what you guys can also do you can take off the true attack or you can take off the dragon's breath and then you can go over to the laser and throw on the vlk or the canted laser the canted is going to make it so you ads like this which is honestly pretty helpful i just prefer to have the other setup but this is also a very very good one and especially if you want to be an asshole on search and destroy which then for the tuning increase the sprint of fire speed and the ads speed then i believe for the vlk it is going to be the same exact tuning yeah it's going to be the same one this is going to be the same thing as the canter you just ads and you guys can see the ads is a lot better now and keep in mind there is a lot of different setups for the weapon i could go on for like three hours and show you guys so many setups but to keep it simple this is the setup that i'm running in the gameplay and just stay tuned for all the other setups because there's a couple secret broken setups with this gun because like reese i can't even record and play you know like right now i'm recording i'm getting down to 80 fps i gotta upgrade that I was going to get a cheaper part, but if I replace my GPU, I also got to replace my power supply. So I'm like, dude, I got to replace like half the things in my computer. Boom, boom, bing, bong, let's go. Oh, you thought, you thought, you thought, oh, you thought, you thought too. Oh, I got your boyfriend. Where, where's your father? Oh, he did. Oh, dude, I am an ass. I don't deserve this at all. I'm going to get so much bad karma. Just like last game, probably. I'm trying to save to build my $900 gaming PC. Hey, you know, I saved up for the one I have right now is about two grand, but I saved up. Worked hard and it's still going. It's still going strong three years later. Let's go. You gotta get this to 25. I am so focused because I feel like some stupid shit's gonna happen. Like they're gonna spawn in my asshole. Randomly. Come on, I Andy, that's for you! Let's go and kidnap. If you're watching this, thank you for the five gifts. That should have been for you, but you did head out of the stream. Yo, if you are new and you want to see the best class setups every single day, know how to terrorize the lobbies and ranked play. Make sure you hit the sub button down below. On my way to 100k. Look at that. Win win. I get 100k. And you get better at the game. Yo, let's go. A like on the stream is appreciated, boys. Let's freaking go. I gotta get Burning Beard on Nuke also. Andy with the 10? Oh, shit! What the fuck? Santa came early. Dude, I did not expect that. What the fuck? Yo, if you're watching this in a video, do W Andy in the comment section. Holy shit, this man just dropped 10 gifted? Back-to-back -back nukes happening right now, boys. W's in the fucking chat. Let's go. Dude, I thought I was gonna get bad karma. Like, I don't deserve to sleep tonight. <laughs> Andy in the comment section if they're watching this because Andy, what a freaking legend. And Kilo, you're a freaking legend too. Also, you know what? W Kilo would be amazing as well because he dropped the big 200 today. Everyone deserves W's. It's like mainly Andy and Kilo. Sorry if I missed some messages. It's just hard to kind of get to everyone, you know? Let's freaking go. If you got gifted a membership, make sure you say thank you. That was a lot of money. And now you got all the cool emotes. You got like the Seabass emotes. You got Seabass Pog one. You got the W's, all the GG's. And I believe though you can use those anywhere on YouTube in any comment section. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Boom, 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 boom. Double nuke for Andy. The 10 gifted. Thank you so much for that. Figured I'd get you another emote. Thank you for that, dude. Thank you so much. You're so generous of Jesus chat. Now, if we get 20 more, I'll get a uh, nuke emote for this. Oh, no, it's already made. Fuck! I'm going to add a nuke emote, which I don't know if I really like it because there's already a nuke emoji. So I might have her make a new one. Let's go. Just so you know, if you do use a shotgun, you're a freaking loser. Straight loser for using the shotgun. You got to own it. You know, you got to take it on the chin. Right now, I'm being a loser. I'm worse than the people who pour the cereal. I mean, fuck. 
I, I fucked it up. I'm worse than the people who pour the milk first. Imagine like a comedian does that on stage. He's like, oh, I, I fucked up joke. I fucked up the joke. Restart, boys, restart. Okay, we're capturing all the stuff, which I don't really like. But I think it's just because the enemies are just completely depressed that they're just getting their asshole on fire. Torched right now, just getting completely torched. Only took about 50 shots. Okay, we can get another one. This is shoot the ship. But you know, I'm gonna keep this as a class in case I need to be a menace, like if the enemies are using it. This is the sh this is the weapon you pull out if you want to piss off the whole lobby. Holy shoot. We are going crazy right now. Absolutely mental on these dudes. Dude, holy shit. Oh, baby. Overwatch Hilo. I gotta call on this nuke soon. I gotta call it in very soon. Do not forget, Seabass. Do not forget like you do every single time. Yo, we're on the 10. Should I get the nuke right now and then call it in? Okay, we're calling this in right now. Let's freaking go. Thank you, Andy. Andy, the legend. Let's go. Bang bomb. Let's go! That's my first ever nuke win ever. <laughs> Yo, I'm glad to take your nuke virginity, the, dude. Okay, how the Mission fuck complete. did you do Solid that? Work. Like, how the fuck do you get a nuke on shipment? The way you do that is subscribing to CBAS on YouTube. That is the number one way to get a nuke. <laughs> on God, I oh, swear. Subscribe to also, part on YouTube um, players. Also. Yo, Andy, you're gonna be in the video. I hope people in the video do W Andy, W Kilo. W kidnass, everyone deserves W's.